Hello again. It was disturbing today to read um, that a person has lost their life after being trapped between a vehicle and a wall or a garage door. Another tragedy that um, could have been averted. If it's interesting in relationship to the old act and the new act, there's still this proliferation of putting chains across doorways on high um, work areas, particularly mechanics workshops, for example. The new act talks about risk management, and this isn't being applied when you think about the work um, undertaken by mechanics and the need to put a chain across the door. So let's look at it briefly. The idea of a chain is to prevent people from walking into a workshop and harming themselves. I can find no evidence of serious harm or deaths of members of the public walking into a workshop and seriously harming themselves. However, there is lots of evidence and recent evidence of people injuring themselves, fractured wrists, dislocated shoulders and so on, of tripping over a chain to walk into a workshop. So the message is not there. The new Health and Safety Act uh, has a way of managing that. And it's as simple as this. Let's manage the risk and change behaviour. Put a sign up, no entry, report to the office. Don't put things about authorised personnel because every salesperson thinks they're authorised to go anywhere. So this applies to everybody. Train the staff that says anybody walks in the workshop, they must go to the office and send them out to report to the office where they can be supervised if they need to go into the workshop. And this includes salespeople. We find within a few weeks, the behaviours change. People ignore the, work, the workshop and go to the office. My experience within uh, two or three decades working in emergency services, I personally know of three people who were killed while um, being run over by their car, either in behind or in front. Accidentally, of course. Now, that's the risk for a mechanic. They're in and out of car all day. And to move to the front, remove a chain, which is an obstacle, the chances, the reality is that one day somebody will get run over and seriously harmed or killed is real. So let's manage the risk. Let's manage the behaviour. Utilising your staff to ensure people don't work into the workshop not only lessens the chance of injury, but improves productivity because the staff aren't being interrupted every five minutes. It reduces minor injuries of skin, knuckles, etc. because they haven't been um, interrupted while um, doing something which enables them to lose concentration and skin their knuckles or cut their hands and so on. So let's manage the risk. Think about the risk and in that way we will ensure people remain unharmed.